So we are in the northeastern corner of what used to be the wood ghetto. And we are the place which was called Radegast or in German Radegast train station. This was just an auxiliary train station on the northern edges of the rail ring road. And because it happened to be in the northeastern edges of the Wurch ghetto, or Litzmannstadt ghetto, the Nazis started to use this still existing wooden structure as a deportation in to the ghetto for the mostly Western European Jews from Germany, Hamburg, Frankfurt, Dresden, but also some Czech Jews, Austrian Jews. Generally, all of those places in Western Europe where there was a need of decreasing the Jewish population and proclaiming the Judenrein as early as in 1940-41, the German Nazis were just going into deportations to the east so that people are waiting in the ghettos in occupied Poland for the final solution to be decided. From 1942, the same station of Radegast became a deportation out of the either labor units or already people brought into the death camp of Kulmhof Amna, which means Helmno, about 80 kilometers northwest of Łódź. Or in summer 1944, just before liberation, throughout August of 1944, over 60,000s of wood ghetto Jews deported into Auschwitz to Birkenau. This is the time when the war is almost over. The Soviet front line is not even 100 kilometers from here. And the German Nazis are absolutely adamant to make sure that the last remaining and still alive community of Polish Jews is deported into the death camp of Birkenau. Everything we are looking at around this original wooden structure is a museum exhibit. This entire place was redeveloped in 2004 on the 60th anniversary of the final liquidation of the Wood Ghetto. It was redeveloped to become a monument to the memory of the civilization of Wood Jews but also a monument to the Holocaust of all of the Jews and Jewish communities that were pushed through by the German Nazis through the territory of Wood Ghetto. Which means not only the already mentioned international Jewish communities that were deported in, but also tens of thousands of Jews from the vicinity of Wood, from Zgierz, Ozorków, Papianice, Alexandru Wutski and dozens of other places. The exhibit is trying to chronologically bring the copies of the transportation list that the Germans were using to deport people in and then from 1942 out of the wood ghetto.